Hi, my name is Isaiah, and welcome to the LACC Digital Media Game Review Corner, or as I like to call it, Len McCurk. And I'm here to inform you whether or not I think a game is good or not. It is currently the winter of 2023, or more commonly known as the second semester of high school. Today, we will be viewing Minecraft, a game that's been out for over 10 years and is known by almost everyone. The first thing I'd like to mention is the character customization. The game does a good job at letting you customize your character by either letting you choose one of the default skins or importing your own. Now onto the gameplay. Basically, you spawn in a world, find a tree, beat it up, craft a wooden pickaxe, mine some stone, craft another pickaxe, and never use the other one again. After that, you can build yourself a house and go mining for diamonds. With those, you can make a diamond pickaxe which can be used to mine obsidian. After you get 10 or so pieces of obsidian, you can build a portal to Ohio. Now, the nether can be a dangerous place, so you need to be prepared, whether it's fighting something out of a German fairy tale or just not paying attention. Before we go on to the next subject, I want to talk about one of my favorite parts of the game, the music. Just listen to this. Now let's talk about the features of Minecraft. One of the things that I liked is that they added Australia to the game. Another neat thing you can find in the game are desert temples, which have a lot of loot in them. You can also download maps like Skyblock, which is one of my favorites. Or you could download an adventure map. If you have played Minecraft before, then you've most likely heard of servers. If not, servers are like Minecraft worlds, except you can play with other people. One of the most popular servers in Minecraft is Hypixel, which has been out since 2013. It has games like Dropper, where basically you fall down a hole in a lane of water, Build Battle, where you battle by building, and Sky Wars, where you fight on a bunch of islands. Another cool server on Minecraft is the Uncensored Library, which contains uncensored reports from Mexico, Russia, and Egypt. And if you ever get bored of Minecraft, you can install mods to make it more interesting. Well, after seeing all that, I give this game an 8.5 out of 10. Okay. And if you like this review, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more reviews, and also check out some of our other videos, too. And if you're a PTHS student, think about what classes to take. Join Digital Media. Here, you get to learn how to use programs like Photoshop and Illustrator. Yeah, so that's about it. See ya.